Today we'll talk about why I choose the Cobalt 24V cordless power tools as my primary tool set. And before I get started, let me be clear that I only use these tools around the house and for most of my project videos you've seen on my YouTube channel. I don't work in the construction business so I don't need any fancy tools. So basically I'm just an average Joe trying to use these tools for my daily activity just like most of us. So the very first reason why I choose the Cobalt 24V tools is because they are brushless. I'm not going into details about what brushless tools are and why you should use them. That will make this video too long, but in short, if you want cordless power tools, brushless is the way to go. Every single Cobalt 24V tool has a brushless motor in it. Unlike many tool brands like DeWalt, Milwaukee and Ryobi, which have both brushed and brushless tools. When you purchase a tool from these brands, you always have to ask yourself whether or not it is brushless. With the Cobalt 24V tools, you never have to ask that question because they are all brushless tools. The second reason why I choose these tools is because of the batteries. The cost of the battery is often even more expensive than the tool itself. And because the batteries wear out faster than your tool, you usually have to replace the batteries before you replace your tools. The Cobalt 24V batteries are the cheapest battery you can get compared to other brands. The 1.5 amp hour battery costs only $10 and 2 amp hour battery costs $20. The price has increased a little bit recently but they are still the cheapest battery of any two brands on the market. Since I'm talking about batteries, I'm going to talk about my personal reason why I choose these tools. If you follow my YouTube channel, you probably already know I'm into electric vehicles, like anything that moves with a battery. I've worked on electric go-kart, electric scooters, electric bikes. All of these need batteries to run. And what batteries do I choose to run my electric vehicle? You guessed it right, the Cobalt 24V Power 2 batteries. Most of my electric vehicles are either 24V or 48V, so I can just use one 24V pack or two 24V packs in series to produce 48V. So these batteries can be used both for my power tools and for my electric vehicles. Almost all of the other tool brands out there use 20V batteries, so you cannot use those batteries on the electric vehicles because the voltage is lower. The inside of a DeWalt battery has only 5 cells, and so does every other brand, whereas the Cobalt battery has 6 cells. So not only is a Cobalt battery cheaper, it also has 20% more energy so you can get even more bang for your bucks. All of the Cobalt batteries use good brand name cells like Sanyo or Samsung. They used to have Sanyo cells, but recently almost all of their battery cells are made by Samsung. And for me personally, the Cobalt 24V battery is the biggest reason why I choose it because it is the only battery I can run my EV and it is the only brand in the market right now that offer 24V batteries instead of 20V. So here is my 48V electric bike and it's being powered by two Cobalt 24V 10 amp hour battery pack. This battery pack is homemade, I made it myself in 2017 and it's been three years and I ride my bike almost every day and it's been working fine and uh, never have any problem with it and it still perform uh, excellent and it's basically made from five of these two amp hour battery packs and I just remove the BMS from four of them and I keep the EMS from one of them and stack them together and it still works as normal as a regular battery pack so I can still use it for my tools. I can still use my original charger to charge the battery. Just like that. And because the 10 amp hour battery is way too big and heavy to carry around, I made a 6 amp hour battery using a 4 amp hour and a 2 amp hour together. So that way I can power a more heavy duty tool than this impact driver and this cordless miter saw. This 6 amp hour actually performs better than when I have a single 4 amp hour and a single 2 amp hour working separately. That's because the 6 amp hour can provide more current so it doesn't have to work as hard when I use a more power tools like these tools. 
So not only does this last longer, it also more powerful. So this one here is my Razer Go Kart, which I'm using two cobalt 25 volt battery pack because I have a 48 volt DC controller here. So it's running on 48 volts and it is pretty fast. Go! <laughs> I can also run this go-kart on a single 24 volt battery pack if I replace this controller with a 24 volt controller but that will give me a slower speed And this one here is the Razer Crazy Card. It still has its original 24 volt controller, so I can only use this with a single cobalt battery pack. But even with a single 24 volt battery pack, it is already way too fast for this go kart. I think if you put a 48 volt battery pack in here, it's gonna be way too fast, and when you try to spin it, it's gonna just fling you out of the go kart. The third reason why I choose the Cobalt 24 v tool is because of their warranty. All of these have 5 year warranty on the tools and 3 year warranty on the batteries. And unlike other tool brands where you have to call in, talk to a rep and ask for an RMA number, then you have to spend time to pack it and ship it back to a manufacturer, wait for who knows how long before they can receive it and then send you a new tool. With the Cobalt tools, you just walk in a Lowe's store present your defective tool with a receipt and 10 minutes later you come out of the store with a new tool. A couple months ago my impact driver died so I brought it to a local Lowe's store showed them the receipt and 10 minutes later I walked out with a new impact driver. No questions asked. And that was the fastest, easiest and the least painful warranty claim I have ever made. The fourth reason why I choose these tools is just simply because they are good quality tools. Compared to other good brand names like DeWalt or Milwaukee, the Cobalt that tools are not far behind. I'd say it's even the same quality or sometimes perform better than these other brands. But the warranty claim from Cobalt just puts other brands to shame. The only problem is that the Cobalt 24 v tool line does not have a lot of varieties like say the Ryobi tools. But the Cobalt has been slowly coming out with new tools and accessories. There are a lot more to choose from right now compared to when they first came out. Talking about new tools, I have words from an insider that they are going to come out with a new Cobalt XLT series that even have more output than the current tools. The new series has three letters X, L and T in it. I'm not sure what particular order it is, but it could be XLT, TXL or XDL, something like that. The new impact driver will be rated at 2000 inch pound of torque instead of the current one with 1800 inch pound. The new 4 amp hour battery will be half the size of the current 4 amp hour battery. Actually, it's not really half the size but half the thickness because they will be using the new 21700 lithium ion cells instead of the older 18650 cells. As of February 2020, these are not even on Lowe's website yet. We have to wait a little bit more before we can see them on the shelves at Lowe's. But I'll be sure to grab one as soon as they come out to do a review for you. That's it for now. These are my favorite tools and I can't imagine my life without them. Don't say this to my wife because the divorce paper is going to come next. <laughs> so how about you? I would love to hear from your own opinion what your favorite power tools are down in the comments below. 
Thanks, and I'll see you next time.